Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Kelvin back with another movie review. This one is for Moonlight. This is probably one of the most highly anticipated, highly recommended, highly sought after film. Uh, I got the chance to see it yesterday. Um, the movie written and directed by Barry Jenkins. This is actually his second film. If you guys haven't seen his first film, Medicine for Melancholy, you guys need to watch that movie. Excellent movie. Um, this one, like I said, it's just, everybody's been talking about it. It's been called, if not one of the best films of 2016, but the best film of 2016. Uh, so the film uh, stars Naomi Harris, Mahershala Ali, Janelle Monet. Um, the movie is about Sharon, uh, who is a, this this uh, young man who is living in Miami, who is always getting picked on, who's always uh, just a person who's going through all of this uh, tough, like just out of experience. Like no kid should probably go through anything that he's been going through, but he has to go through it, and he has to go through it basically by himself. His mom's on drugs. Uh, he, there's some questions, uh, you know, really about his sexuality, and the movie really explores that as well. I thought the writing was excellent. I thought the, just Barry Jenkins' direction and what he wanted to do with this film was just so breathtaking. Um, it puts you in moods that you never thought that you would ever see in a movie. It made you, it made you feel for these characters. And, and I love that about this movie because you wanted to see Chiron or Black as he's also called in the movie. You wanted to see him, you know, like rise above everything. You wanted to see what his next move was. You wanted to know what was going to happen with him um, and you wanted to know what his relationship was with his mother, what his relationship was with with Blue, what his relationship was uh, with his best friend. Um, all of these get, you know, explored in this movie. Um, I thought Naomi Harris, who, I, who I've always been a fan of and I still remember just being a fan of hers since 28 Days Later love that movie she knocks it out of the park Mahershala Ali who is on a string of just like good stuff he's he's an amazing actor Janelle Monet really surprised me in this movie I hadn't seen Hidden Figures yet but she's done an excellent job in this movie I can't really remember the the three um, actors who play uh, Sh uh, Sharon um, but they did such an amazing job like and you really cared about all three guys who played the same character um, it was just compelling it was uh, it was amazing it was an amazing watch I suggest everybody go watch this movie it's really fascinating now here's what my I guess my input would be I think I will agree that this is probably one of the best films of 2016. Do I think it is the best movie of 2016? Honestly, I don't know. Um, and I think it, it's, it's just because every, it was just so hyped. And, and I really enjoyed the movie. I really enjoyed the movie a lot. Um, maybe I need to see it again and then maybe come up with the conclusion to that question but hey you know you guys tell me what you think if you've seen the movie go check it out if you live in paducah kentucky it is at the maiden alley cinema in downtown paducah you guys can check out this review not only on the facebook page but also on youtube as well and until then we'll see you next time peace